Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon X only. And I have not played this in, for a, a long period is because the reason I've been doing a lot of uh, Minecraft, as, as you can see, and um, and uh, Batman, the video game with the uh, the locks on that, and and I decided to do it uh, again, do some Pokemon series going through, and and here we go. We're gonna go ahead and go to and see where we have to go here. So we're gonna go up in here and uh, see what we have to do here. So let's see. Where do we need to go? Oh, I gotta. Is something wrong in the frost cavern, mammal swine? Sleazy. Um, sounds like it. Hmm. Wonder. Are you headed to frost cavern, trainer? This mammal, mammal swine, is here. Is usually can't get through enough of giving people rides on Route 17. Oh, sweet. But. These days, it seems to be too worried about something in the frost cavern to get rides. Uh, I wonder what he's worried about right now. Mammal Swine is a Pokemon that loves cold climates, so maybe it has sensed something amiss in the frost cavern. Oh. Nice to show you. Nice to see you pop up, uh, Trevor. And you are? My name is Trevor. I'm researching the distribution of Pokemon in the Kalos region at Pro Professor Sakamore's re request. Okay. I see. So that's why you're walking clear out in the Frost Cavern then? Mammal Swine seems concerned about something over there, so be careful. I will, thank you. What are you going to do, Survival? I'm going to prepare my for... I'm going to, I'm going to prepare for my expedition. Uh, I wonder what that is, man. I really do. Well then. I like the actual angle of this. I really do. Like how they uh, made the angle in any way. Um... I do really like the angle how they uh, put the uh, graphics into this game here. It's really interesting how they did that. But, ladies and gentlemen, here's Frost Cavern. And I'm excited to go through this, really. <laughs> so I'm gonna go right there. Yep,s missed that person. But there might be a trainer or some wild Pokemon here that I could skip. Um, but I do know how to get through this cave in any way, but getting to the, the core of this cave, it's going to be a big surprise, pretty much. So we got to make sure our team is ready to go. And so we've got power at 43. We've got flame at 41. We've got diggers at 45. We got firefox, the one we started with at 46 then we got transport which is really way behind and it's level 30 th 38 and turtle is the one we got from the professor and it's at 43 all right so that's our team and let's hope we can actually do this all right now mm. I don't think well Well then, um, you know what, I'm actually going to bring out a uh, turtle here, right away here, because um, I just don't want to expect anything. <laughs> so, ooh, so a little uh, ice escapade right there. But yes, you can go diagonal, but doing it right is what matters. 
See what I mean? Just doing it right is what matters. And we got we get into a battle here, and it is gonna be Jinx. I'm pretty sure you guys don't remember me saying in my Pokemon Red version, but if you guys do, um, Jinx is actually a Link trade. If you trade a Poliwhirl in the um, one of the houses in. Uh, certainly in city where the uh, second gym is um, but if you guys don't remember that it's okay it's been a long time I played that game naturally but as of right now I'm currently as of right now waiting on that because I'm like three episodes away of completing it and there's nothing really else to do in that game other than just battle the elite four over and over and over and over and again and I don't think you guys want to see that. <laughs> so, naturally, yes. <laughs> naturally. Unfortunately. That's how it's going to be for now. And I'm plan um, in the future, as of right now, I'm planning on doing um, Crystal version um, of Pokemon. And, um,. I'm just gonna leave it in the comments leave leave in the comments below of what you think of what game I should play, but it has to be Pokemon. What game you think I can do the way I'm doing it in a way where I can actually play the actual game itself. Alright. So, here we go. We're gonna go ahead and start. But we're gonna actually run this battle. Since we're, you know, eligible to run. <laughs> but we've got an item here. Ooh, Ice Heal. Alright. So we're going to go ahead and go through here. If we can. Ah! Wow, really? Oh, that bites. Do you see that? That really bites. Did not want to go and do a battle again. Oh! Hello, swine! It's actually the... The actual, um... The evolution form of mammal swine. So... We're gonna go ahead and run. And, uh, we get away safely. Sweet. Ah! And we go way back at the start. Really? Come on now. There we go. We got we're right where we needed. <laughs> it's like the most annoying part. It's just that alone. Can we get... Oh, snap. Can we get past this guy? Yes, we can. But unfortunately, we can't pass this lady. Unfortunately not. So, looks like we're going to be battling here. Unfortunately. You are challenged by Battle Girl Kinsey. And she comes out with Sock. Wow, okay. Sock is actually a good Pokemon. But it does have ability uh, that allows it to... Um, Withstand any hit. Which means sturdy is actually the ability there. But unfortunately, I could do a, let's see, Aqua Tail here. But unfortunately, it's a little faster. I didn't see what it, oh, uh, what? You really avoided my attack? Well, guess what? I've got a surprise for you, man. I really do. I got a surprise for you, unfortunately. Since you want to avoid my attack, I'm going to come out with flame. Unfortunately, yes. Ha! Huh. You think that attack is going to get me down? I wonder what attack that is. But you know what? You got burn. You got burn, man. My man, you just got burned. Oh, you're going to do... Ooh. 
Poison Jab didn't even do nothing. He just got burned again. But you know what? We're gonna go ahead and, uh, it's that roost, man. It's that roost. We gotta heal up here, which is kinda nice. And we're gonna, he's gonna do that poison jab here, which doesn't really do a whole lot on him because of his attack. <laughs> Burn basically reduces your attack, so that's what's really neat. So we're gonna go ahead and fly here. We're gonna go fly up in the sky. And he his attack missed, and he get burned. But you know what? Unfortunately for you, you're down for the count. Yep, bye. <laughs> Diggers went to level 46. And Kenzie is coming out with Min Chow. You know what? Why worth the risk, right? See what she's got on this thing. And I'm gonna fly up again, and she's gonna do. Oh! Good thing I flew up too, because she was gonna do rock slide there, which would nearly would take me out. Unfortunately, yes, like I said, it was gonna take me out. Yes, it did indeed. Because I'm weak to that four times, unfortunately. Because I'm fire and flying and rock towards that. It's four times. So, yeah, unfortunately I got myself out there. But. I'm going to come out with Firefox even though I'm still weak to that. But not as powerful towards my bird type. So, I'm going to go ahead and do a side shock here. Yeah, goodbye. Bye bye. You're my weakest link. What TV show is that from? Do you, does that, do you guys, any, any of you know about that uh, TV show? But here's the thing Who knows and who says? Goodbye, you're my wickest link. Leave in the comments below of what you think. Of who says that. And in the next episode, probably tomorrow or sometime in the later in the week. Um I will tell you who says that, but I can't remember the actual host's name. But I can tell you the actual show. The actual show's name. Which is not on TV anymore. So just keep that in mind. It's not on TV anymore. But I can still tell you the name of the show that was on TV. Now Firefox went to level 47 and is now learning the Willow Wisp. Which actually does burn your opponent on contact. But, unfortunately, if it misses, it will not burn your opponent. It's like a status move, pretty much. So, since I got really good moves on um, Firefox here, I'm just going to keep the same moves here. And, uh, and yes, you can get the actual Will-O-Wisp um, TM in this game, unfortunately. But finding it is the problem. Um, I think I do have it, but I don't know for sure, 100%. So, we're going to go ahead and, uh, oh, that was dumb. <laughs> that was really dumb. Just going, and I get trapped, like nowhere else to go, <laughs> unfortunately. So, I'm going to go ahead and go down this ladder here, and this lady right here, Heals up your Pokemon. Let's make a Bivaric so we can rest and restore your Pokemon's health. Thank you. I needed that. So that lady right there is well nice to you. No battle needed. You just, you talk to her and you rest up pretty much. But unfortunately I'm going to avoid this trainer here. But 
we're almost at the core here. So just keep in mind, we're almost at the core. Okay? We're almost there. It's just now a matter of time getting there is what matters. Not right there, right where I can get. Oh, you had to get in my way. Now, in case you guys didn't know or did know, this is actually Bear Tick, very um, an ice type, which um is only found here. But can get I move? Oh, you guys seen that? That was pretty close. Did you see that? That was pretty close, especially with the trainer there there but unfortunately we've got a surprise uh trainers up here which we are going to be battling here it's really cold in here is it survival is there something going up ahead there's a baba snow is a fine specimen it's absolutely brimming with energy the more we agitate it, the stronger it, the snow warning ability becomes, making the snow fall even more fiercely. Let's catch it swiftly and get out of here. <laughs> hey! Well? Hey, you Pokemon thieves! What are you doing here? Oh, what does it look like? We're catching Pokemon! Why else would we grab all those Pokeballs? It was also... We could catch powerful Pokemon like the Zababa Snow. It's full of... Potential... Potent energy. Energy? <laughs> You're not the brightest one, are you? has the most Pokemon and the most energy will come up at the top. Lazy people who just wait for things to be handed to them don't have to be don't have these resources. But why is Team Flare amassing Pokemon energy and money? To put it another way, why is Team Flare always trying to get take everything for itself? Allow me to spell it out for you. So it's so Team Flair, own and only Team Flair can survive. She didn't really spell it out anyway, so why why say it if you didn't really spell it? But come on. After all, why should we care about saving people who aren't on our side? Anyway, I don't mind a healthy curiosity, but I'm afraid I just don't have any more time of you. Survival. Did they say only Team Flare will survive? These people have few screws loose. Indeed they do. <laughs> <laughs> you too. Hurry up and send these kids packing. Right away, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Go, Team Flare. This is the trademark pose of Team Flare. It's the very definition of fashionable. You are challenged by Team Flare Grunt, and it's going to be a female anyway. So, and she's coming out with a Crobat, unfortunately. So, with this Crobat is a poison and flying type, which Ah, oh, I don't have a move on me that I could take it out. Well, let me think here. Let me just think. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna switch out here and I'm gonna give you guys a surprise. It's gonna be none other than... Firefox. 
And I hate that noise. I really do. The noise that it gave, that it, that it came out with. It's like, hi, hi, hi. It's like, oh my god, it's just really annoying just the way it sounds. But you know what? I'm gonna do Shy Shock here. Take that. Go back. But she might come out with a fire type, which I do have a chance of winning here. Flame went to 42. Not bad. Oh, Manatrek. You know what? This is actually a good opportunity for... Who else? And you guys know who's on my team. Diggers! Suits him well. Come on now. Come on, Diggers. Let's see what you got here. Since he is pretty good leveled here. And... I'm gonna do a... Let's see. Try to avoid his attack here and see what he's got. So I'm gonna go ahead and go dig under the ground here. And whoop! I'm gone. Just for only a turn, though. <laughs> Ding! But, that doesn't mean I can still get paralyzed. But I can still get... It off me somehow, so... How do you think I could reverse time to point before I lost? Uh, there's no time for that. You just lost, lady. Come on now. I may have lost. I may have lost, but... Isn't this Winter Wonderland beautiful? Almost as beautiful as the... Team flare pose. So, looks like we ain't done here yet. So, looks like we gotta take care of whatever her n name is. I, which we'll figure out who this is. Um, fortunately. So, we're gonna go ahead and go into our bag here and uh, find a. Well, it looks like we got full restore, so we're gonna go ahead and use that. All right, now we got our team fully healed, except for the moves, okay? Now, here we go. Hmm, you're more powerful than you look. I wonder how much energy is there in inside you? Whoa, <laughs> I like her already. And team player, Babel, is gonna be f challenging us here. And she comes out with Houndoom. And you know what? For her, unfortunately for her, Houndoom, we coming out with... What else? Turtle, of course. So, if you guys are ready, hit that like button below. And show me your support. And we're going to finish this battle with a nice ending here. With a Aqua Tail and... But you know what? We don't take it out. We could still have a chance here. But you know what? We took her out, no problem. Not just strong, too strong. Not ordinary, indeed. Oh, you're telling me I'm not ordinary? I have no patience for losing. Let's get out of here. Doesn't battling with Team Flare scare you, Survival? I admit it scares me. I don't like battling them. But we managed to protect ba Obama Snow by pitching it in here. I know, I'm the... Re Reverse type, okay? I'm okay with that. <laughs> but 
it's important to be bold when necessary. Mammal Swine doesn't have to worry about Obama Snow anymore, and that's what matters. All that ends well. <laughs> and he's right about that. But we have one little gift from Obama Snow here, and we're going to go ahead and grab it from him. What's this? Looks like Obama Snow wants to give you something. And we got the Obama Sight. Which allows Obama Snow to mega evolve with that stone. But I think like later on in the game there is something back here, but I don't really recall what. Yep. But you know what? Let's see we got a um Oh, you know what? We've got a Pokemon here that has Dig. You know what? We're going to go ahead and use it here. And we are out of the cave. No problem. So we're going to go ahead and run all the way down here through this nice little path that they got here and bloop, down here but to end it off to a nice ending here I'm gonna do one last battle to end it off to show one last thing, just to have a good ending in any way, in any Pokemon game that does exist. I'm going to end it off in a nice ending here. So I'm going to show you here what I'm talking about here. But before I do continue on to the uh, journey to uh, route, I... Uh, don't recall what route it is but you know what there's a boulder here so we're gonna wait on that but I'm gonna go in the grass area here and oh this fungus is just gonna be toast so to end it off here with a nice ending here. We're going to go ahead and do Aqua Tail and to finish it off. And we're going to go ahead and do the Mega Ring right here. And we're going to Mega Evolve Turtle here. And he's going to Mega Evolve with nice three cannons. And I'm going to do Aqua Tail. But that doesn't mean we're going to end the battle that easy. So we're going to go ahead and do Water Pulse here. Even though it's not very effective, but... But just to end the battle, or to end the game, or this episode, with that in, in hand. So... Cast your Pokeball at that at that like button and hit that like button and try to capture it in any way. And and also post that uh, post this video so that everybody can see this video. And if you like this video, like I said, throw that Pokeball out there and let it hit that like button and let it catch it in any way. So I'll catch you guys later. I'm your host, Survival Man One. Peace out.